Good morning and welcome back to your own channel. Seek the soul, the truth lies within. And for you, especially those who have come for the first time and the old listeners too, have a look at the link down below in the playlist. It will take you to that playlist and there you can check out topics on depression, topics on relationships, topics on parenting, alpha attitude, yoga asanas, and chair exercises and many more things are given down below. Have a look and let's go ahead with today's blessing, 243rd day of a godly blessing. Baba wants us to transform from within in such a manner that anybody who looks at you or looks into your eyes has a vision of something divine. Let's explore what exactly is that divinity which God wants us to explore. Baba says, may you transform your vision and attitude and become an image that grants visions and so transform the world. So transform your vision, the way we look at people, the way we look at things and situations. If we change that on a spiritual level, then everything around us will change. Let's get into the details. Baba says, make your vision divine by transforming of your attitude and many souls will see their real form if i change my attitude at looking at things instead of saying that oh this situation makes me feel hurt or this situation or this person if his attitude is like this it makes me feel irritated or i get frustrated when that person talks like that this is the attitude which needs to change the vision of seeing things needs to change otherwise we are spreading hatred we are spreading that what we are exactly feeling at that moment if I'm feeling frustration, vibrations of frustration are coming out. If I'm feeling hate, hate vibrations are spreading in the world and in the surroundings, whether be it office, be it your home, be it your workplace or anywhere else. So Baba says, don't do that. The, your attitude and many souls will see the real form, their real home. So other souls will see that, yes, they also have this quality within them. They can also use this quality to do the same work which they were doing through anger, through frustration, through ordering around, through pushing people. But now when you do that same thing with the right attitude of spirituality and get the same work done with the right attitude, then people will transform. They'll feel, okay, this is what I've not been using. I've been keeping myself from using these qualities. I should have used them long back. Unnecessarily, I was getting angry increasing my blood pressure unnecessarily i was getting frustrated creating stress and tension in my life but i was spoiling my health now i can do it with the same attitude of spirituality let's try it out so then baba says and their real home and their real kingdom so souls will see the real home where they have come back from and where they have to go back to and their real kingdom from your vision now in order to give them that real vision what do we have to do let there not be the slightest mischievousness of body consciousness. If body consciousness is there, automatically all the negative thoughts and feelings and the negative attitude and the negative habits come back. Two, three days we are spiritual. Fourth, fifth day again we get irritated or frustrated by small things. That is what is God is saying. That is a means of making your soul consciousness go down and increasing body consciousness. The more body consciousness, the more of negative attitude which we use. The more of negative qualities we start using for our karmas. And then we become heavy, other people also become heavier. They feel trapped, we feel trapped. Now Baba says, Reform your attitude and make your vision divine and this world will be transformed. The vision has to be turned into a divine vision. Those who see you will experience your eyes to be not just eyes when they look at you look at look in your eyes they will just not see your physical eyes but containers of magic through your eyes you can give them direction through your eyes they'll understand what you are thinking what you're feeling in the worldly ways also i can make my eyes big and show anger i can make my eyes big and show i am completely surprised or i'm taken aback God says with those divine eyes, with the eyes of divinity, that means your thoughts will make those energies or vibrations flow through your eyes and the other souls will feel those vibrations and they'll either feel calmness, coolness, 
happiness or they'll feel that yes everything is clear they found the solution they found the answers either that or what you have been giving them till today that is fear maybe frustration maybe irritation maybe sadness which is flowing through your eyes and baba says not just eyes but containers of magic your eyes will become a means to give them visions visions of their real self not the impure self not the not the one which is been using the negative qualities to get things done in life or achieve things in life not that vision but the vision of who they really are the purest part of them within they'll see through our eyes and for that this third eye or the soul that i am and that you are has to be purified first and that is not an easy task but with god's help with meditation on god not on a candle not on a point on the wall not on your breath but on god meditation on god with god in his company makes it happen so i leave you with this beautiful beautiful vardhan a blessing if you like something out of it if you've experienced something like this do share it in the comment box and if you like this do share it with others benefit them help them out and have a safe day stay safe om shanti